Got another video from Mean and Transmissions, two locations, one in Willow Grove and one in Lansdale. We reach at meanandtransmissions.com. Uh, transmission we're talking about today is a, it's a 5R110 torque shift transmission. This is in a Ford application, actually. This is a F250 pickup truck uh, with a gas engine, 5.4 gas engine. So just look at the uh, parts we saw. Um, this is the drum that resides behind the pump. This is actually called the coast clutch cylinder. Now this coast clutch cylinder, we look here, you can even see that it's designated to be gas. Uh, so this drum is different than the one in the uh, diesel application. Well, this drum actually broke. Uh, this is not supposed to spin separately here. Let me see if I can get a better shot here. Okay, that's supposed to be one piece. And you can see that this, uh, this assembly is, uh, is dented right here and uh, it actually sheared off so it's welded internally and that failure allowed this outer portion of the drum to interact with this return spring on the back side of the pump just go over the parts inside uh, here is the return spring here no it's difficult okay here's that coast clutch cylinder right here so uh, on top of the regular rebuilding items we're going to have some internal uh, hard parts required this particular clutch drum. Also, the center support in the unit showed uh, showed some evidence. The let's see here. Okay, ceiling ring clearances on the center support. The top ceiling ring seems to be okay. Not a lot of movement. This bottom ceiling ring seems to have a lot more movement. I don't know whether this is coming up good on the video but you see how that's flopping around when we air check this it did seem to have a lot of leakage so we're going to do a little investigative work uh, may potentially need to replace that center sport as well if the ring land in the center sport is in fact the worn item as opposed to the ring itself so uh, this transmission is a five speed uh, this is used in the diesel applications as well uh, have had a pretty good uh, history with this transmission uh, sometimes uh, people won't question whether you know this transmission is as good as the Allison but from what our experience has been uh, not a high failure rate transmission